Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we are going to start a new achievement. Let's play. It's going to be a very quick one. We're going to do the world of 1776, and we're going to play Ooh Us. Ah. Options going in are everything on whatever. Oh, apparently on Iron Man, they no longer let you do... Oh. On Iron Man, th before 1.4, they used to let you change the difficulty to hard. And you used to be, I think you'd be able to change bonuses. But apparently we can't do any of that. So, okay. Now the settings are locked in. Let's get in. Ah, we'll call it um, USA Achievements. One thing to note is the bigger font mod. I think it's called Better UI Mod. Can't see anything now because the mod is not compatible with 1.4 patch for the game. It's too bad. Alright, so we are the USA... And we have to fight for independence. We're at war with Britain and English Louisiana, English West Indies, Newfoundland, and the 13 colonies. Although I'm pretty sure the 13 colonies don't exist. Oh no, they do. Right there. Hello. So, the way you get this achievement, or what, no, not, not the way you get it, but the goal of the achievement is to own all of your cores. And we do. We already own all of our cores, so all we have to do is get peace. That's it. So, uh, would you like peace? No. What about if I concede defeat? Nope. What about if I give you money? Um, he's not interested in money. So, money won't work. We're, gonna have to, we're actually going to have to fight him. Which sounds fun, because we have... Uh, well, 33... We have 36,000 troops total. And he has... Um, a lot more than 36,000 troops. A lot more. What's our force limit? 43. So we can... Rec oh my god, we have like a billion generals. Wow. Wow. Look how many generals we have. There's a 3-4. i put the 3-4 in my big stack. And uh, you can have a 2-3... No, we have a 3-3. Three, three. There you go. I can't believe we have so many generals. There's our shippy ships. Uh, I guess we could patrol during war, but that sounds like it might be a bad idea. Is Britain involved in any other wars? No, this is his only war. Oh, he has protectorates, and he has a personal union over Hanover. He has Colonial Overlord over Newfoundland, the 13 Colonies, Louisiana, and West Indies. He has Carnatic, Ode, and Koch as protectorates. Carnatic. Uh, down here. Carnatic, Ode, and Koch. Over there, Koch, as protectorates. Okay. France is over here in uh, India as well. Portugal's here too. Very cool. Alright, so we can't just take out loans. People are saying to do this, the quickest way is just to take out loans. But we can't. It just doesn't work. Um, yeah, convert something. Go ahead. We have a colonist, but that's not really going to help us. We, I'm sure we have colonial range. But it doesn't really do any good if there's no colonies available. Oh, there are. African coast is not, not taken at all. Oh, is there, oh my god, look at this. 4,000... Natives, 5,000, 5,000, 14,000 natives. Oh my god, 12,000, 8,000, 7,000, that's a lot of natives. I've never seen 15,000 natives in gold. Holy shit. Ha! Huh. That's insane. That is insane in the membrane. 15,000 natives. Oh, we could colonize the southern tip of South America. It feels like it's just a waste of money, though. Alright, so... We'll get some battles going here. We have Tech 27, I think? We're Tech 27, and so's Britain. So, that's fine. Yep, Tech 27. We're all the same. What idea groups do we have? We have Defensive... Religious, economic, we're doing offensive right now. We have plutocratic. Okay. 
Naval trade. Okay. And American traditions give us an extra merchant, more religious unity, and Republican tradition plus 0 0.5. We are a republic. Okay. Constitutional republic with president... The, shouldn't it be president of the Continental Congress? Ah, whatever. Is there an advisor for morale? There is. Okay, there's an advisor for morale. That sounds like a plan. Wow, that's expensive. 69 ducats for a level 1 advisor? Wow. Okay. And uh, better relations. There's nobody for the Navy. That's the only thing I'd be interested in. Production efficiency plus one. Yeah, we make a lot of money off production, so that's probably worth it. Hmm. 4.3 ducats, though. Yeah, we'll do it. In the meantime, let us... Let's see, I don't need that. I don't need that. Um, I don't really want to build anything. National decisions available. Ah. We have a mission to conquer Florida. Ha ha ha. Um, oh yeah, France's opinion. France, do you want to do you want to help me in my war? We don't have any allies, do we? Let me check. We have no relations at all. No marriages. No. Oh, we can't do marriages for a republic. But yeah, you want an alliance? No. Damn. Hmm. Sorry, I'm still looking around. I'm. Um, Learning. Everyone now has personalities. That's kind of neat. Yeah, why don't we use one of our diplomats to get relations up with um, whoever hates Britain. Who hates Britain? Oh, no one has any enemies yet. All right, well, I can do that. There you go. You're an enemy. You're an enemy. And uh, let's get relations up with France. Um... There's no admirals available. Well, here, have an admiral. How come we have like 30 generals and no admirals? That makes no sense. All right, patrol Chesapeake. And um, yeah, get up in there. Let's build some more units. Although, oh my God, our manpower is just crap. Fine, get me some mercenaries. Thirty-seven ducats for those. No, I think we'll just go with soldiers. It's just so expensive. Actually, get me a cannon. There you go. All right, let's um, speed up to three and let's go. Let's go kill some Brits. Whoa, that is a lot of things. Denmark, tell us about the events of fish that have happened to their nation recently. Fish. Oh, it's just people doing blasphemy act. Do I need to know about these? When they execute a decision, um, I guess we don't need to know those. I turned on a lot of um, things. Improved relations, I don't need to know that. Because the 1.4 patch turned off all the pop-ups, like all of them, so I turned them all back on. Oh my god, that is... Oh, provinces are converting to the Protestant faith. Okay. All right, I'm just going to hit enter through all this crap. That's a lot of crap. Wow, that's a lot of crap. And it's still going. Still going. Okay, there we go. <laughs> wow, we have merchants everywhere. We have a ton of merchants. Oh, he's actually going to... Oh, he's trying to get to Nipmuc. Um, what's the terrain like? Plains. Plains. It doesn't matter where we fight. Ah, uh, new alliances. Yeah, that's fine. Act of uniformity. I don't need to know about that. Thanks. Okay. I guess I can go through my decisions, huh? Merchant shipping would be trade efficiency, more mercantilism, national tax goes down, spend admin points. 
Importation Act. Uh, lose mercantilism, national ta trade goes up. Mining Act. Trade efficiency goes down. Production. Well, what are we making most of our money? We make most of our money from production and then trade. Not much on tax. So anything that lowers taxes should be fine. National tax. Yeah, that's fine. Popery Act. Okay. Dissolution of the monasteries. National tax goes up. Civility cost goes up. Um, no, we don't need it. Test Act. Missionary strength. Don't need it. Don't need it. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and do those so we can convert a little faster. Tax goes down, but stability cost goes down as well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do both of those. So overall, tax will go up by two, and stability cost will go down by three. Yeah. Overall, those are good. Acts of uniformity. Okay. Missionary strength. Okay. Mining act. Um, gain mercantilism. I do like mercantilism. I do. Okay. Battle's going pretty well. And they have no general. I like that. Oh, we have 8.4 morale. Wow. Pretty good. The non-possessor non movement were among the options they went with to support the church authorities. Okay, whatever. Colonial assembly. Okay, maybe I should turn some of these off. They're getting... Colonial assembly. Fine, turn them off. Turn them off. Encounter NATO's encountering our colonies. Let's turn them off. Alliances. I do want to know that. Refuses the merchants of Prussia access their... It's just an embargo. I don't need to know about embargoes. Okay. So we crushed that army. We got 4% for crushing that army. Um, why don't we all meet up in Penacook? Kangra is improving relations with Britain. No, I don't need to know that. Thanks, though. Um, what do we do here? Natives encountering our colonies. Gain base tax. Finish the colony quickly. It's better. Merchant arrived at Novgorod. When a merchant arrives at a trade node, I don't need to know that. Thanks. Aspiration of liberty. I don't need to know about that. Yup. 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 Trade embargo. I don't need to know that either. Thank you, though. I don't think I need to know about marriages. Alliances I do want to, but not marriages. Okay, so we're starting to get some of our mercenaries. That means we can start sieging stuff. Do we have any claims on anything? I thought we would have claims on 13 colony land, but I guess we don't. Yeah, we don't have claims on any of the 13 colonies. That's surprising. Huh. Alright. They were crushed. That's good. Uh, let's do the same thing over here. So we've won the first two initial battles. They don't want peace. Will they accept a surrender? No. Okay. Well, it's fine. Breaking alliances, whatever. Oh no, Britain's embargoing us. Guess what? We'll embargo you right back, you piece of shit. Hey, France hates you. Still can't offer France an alliance, and the war's been going on too long, so I can't even invite them. But at least France hates them, right? Oh, these are colonies. Oh, we can go steal these colonies. Really? The 
this is a colony. We can steal it. Oh, I hadn't even thought of that, but yeah, some of these are still colonies, apparently. Hmm. These two. And this one. Alright, um... I'll go steal them, I guess. I don't need to know about that. We discovered a bunch of Africa. Good for us. And we have conquest on Oyo that I don't really want. But thanks. You know what? Get relations up with Spain as well. They like us. Yeah. Okay. I don't need to know about that. Thanks. Oh, we have to choose somebody. Oh, we can't keep our stupid Continental Congress, but he's so good. Um, hmm. I think we can safely kick some of these generals. We don't need George Washington. We don't need anybody that's a 2-2 two -two or worse. We don't need even the 2-3 we probably don't need. Kick him. I'll just do that. Because our max is only one leader. Hmm. Let's go with the diplomat candidate. Alright. So President Lawrence Clinton is our first president. Oh. When we dismiss a leader, I don't need a pop-up. Thanks, though. Election happened to us. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Let me just go kill those guys. Okay. Kill them all. Yeah, our economy is pretty robust. Let's get some more mercs. Pleased to be getting more mercs. There you go. Okay, they're dead. Good, good. Um, I can turn that off. Go steal the colony. Because it's the nice thing to do. It really is. So he's bringing over 14 more dudes. That should be fine. All we have to do is defend our capital, which is Lenape. Because, you know, the American capital was always in Lenape. Well, Philadelphia, yeah. All we have to do is defend that. We're going to get free war score. Oh, we apparently won a naval battle. Good for us. We even stole two ships. Nice. Group up. Looks like they're starting to carpet siege a little bit. And yeah, well, that'll be easy for us to take out, I guess. Alright, um... Wait, what? It's a colony. Why does it have a fort? It's a colony with a fort. No, just assault that fort. Why does a colony have a fort? What the hell? Hold on. Committee of Safety. Uh, what does this do? Morale of armies goes up, costs us money, or gain prestige. So for 10 years we have better morale. Oh, I want that. Um, yeah, just hold on for a few months and then we can accept it. Failed to siege. God damn it. It's a, it's a colony and we have to siege it? Really? Really? Okay, mercs are getting done. Move in.
Oh shit, I forgot I need the money right now. Oops. Oh, Britain's here with their navy. 12 trade ships. Oh, there's a big navy there. 10 and 15. Uh, we might be able to beat that, but we can't beat that if we have to fight all of these guys at the same time. If we fight just this navy, we can whoop its butt. So I'm not sure. Hmm. All right, let's go south and let's go start beating up these clowns. Uh, yeah, don't worry about the colony. I don't really care if he has colonies. Oh, new government. Feudal monarchy. Okay. That's interesting. Okay, two mercs. Why don't you guys go siege the colony for me? Thank you. down. Sweden's improving relations with us. Okay. That should die very easily, although we are rolling zeros. Oh yeah, that's better. 102 ducats. So next month we can hit the button on that one. Um, yes, go to that one. Oh, Britain's raising troops over here. Interesting. Okay, hit the button. Good. More morale. Uh, looks like we might be a little outnumbered over here, but we'll see. <laughs> 